Hello, this is Okro Belzer, and welcome to Belzer Strategic Arcane. Uh, this is my continuing multiplayer match versus Tanaka with uh, Solomon's campaign scenario. It comes with Strategic Command, World War II, War in the Pacific. I'm the United States. He's, he's Japan. Let's go. This is episode 11, so January 6th, 1943. That's my birthday. Constantly have to be reminded of uh, some crap to have in Washington, D.C. every damn year now. <laughs> I'm old enough. I don't even want, I don't want to remember my birthday. Anyway, uh, so we got uh, Admiral Halsey <clears throat> has tentatively, well, we have attacked the Japanese that are blockading Guadalcanal. We're going to shove more more troops in, into there, and we're engaging the fleet. <clears throat> One of my carriers has uh, lost a lot of its planes on bombing runs, uh, so I'm going to probably return him back to Esperanto Santo. Uh, okay. I was looking at stretch guys should be getting some units here in the next couple turns and I think also the weather might start turning sour it doesn't look sour right now oh, he's got a second sub that's brutal sub against the destroyer still getting used to the 3d sprites here yeah we don't use it no come to dance shell I'm sure Tanaka knows that they can shell, they got ranges. No, oh, another destroyer. What else he got? Oh, crap. Come on, evade, boys. Tanaka's probably on that destroyer. <laughs> All right. Yeah, he's got other units on transfer. I wonder if he's going to just stuff the island. This could be a big mistake, man, <clears throat> on his part. If you have all these all these troops here and he gets isolated, uh, of course, I'm going to have to counter with troops. I like to get behind him. But I think I've got to knock the fleet down to size for spear. Yeah, yeah I've got the Miracle uh, Division just came in. We had to land, man. This is expensive, by the way. My docks are blown. I can't just park a transport there. Yeah. And my fighter isn't, uh, oh, that's, he's attacking the fighter. Yeah, it's hard for me to tell between that and attack bomber. He might lose this and it's going to be expensive. He's using all of his carriers and they're on bomber mode. Crap, come on, survive. Have. I might have to just operate them out or keep them there. I don't know. Yeah, we moved them, we saved our shells. Ah, brutal. No. Yeah, he's he's gonna he's he's gonna fill the island up, man. What the hell is that? Is that artillery too? Different kind, field artillery and heavy artillery. He's bringing them all down. I can't intercept him. Wow, fighters survived, but it might not next turn. God, the Denver light cruiser sunk the Benson destroyer. Okay. Tales of the South Pacific. Oh, I remember this, and it was a musical, too. It's a fictional story set in World War II Solomon's Tales of the South Pacific, a Pulitzer Prize winning collection of interconnected short stories by James A. Michener, who wrote a lot of good books. Delves into the Solomon Islands wartime experiences during World War II, drawing from his own observations and anecdotes, gathered while stationed as a lieutenant commander in the U.S. Navy on Island Espiritu Santo in uh, New Hebrides Islands. Michener crafted a vivid narrative, originally written in 1946, published in 1947. The book inspired the Broadway musical South Pacific in 1949, followed by film adaptations in 1958. And, oh, there's one in 2001? Well, I didn't know that. <clears throat> in New Guinea, the U.S. 32nd Infantry Division recaptures Buna. Allied morale boosted as U.S. Marine reinforcements arrive. Oh, joy. 
what else? It's a division too, second division. I lost first division. A raider and an army. Okay. Well, before we place these, let's look at the situation here. Oh, you did back off. How much is it going to cost to repair you? I need 161. Fuck. I'm going to have to operate them out, I think. Well, let's go look here. You're damaged. I need to reinforce you. How much? Four. I do got to bring more troops in. What do I got? Can't. Oh yeah, that's right. Number two regiment. Let's get you out here. Yeah, I don't have time to upgrade these. Now I have another fighter. He's got to be running out of supply. Can't tell. Seven, supply seven by shooting like his supply six. Uh, what the hell is this? Heavy artillery. Okay. Yeah, that's not good. Okay. His morale is so low. I really can't pull him back. <sighs> da, 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 da. Let's reinforce this. Yeah. Let's move you in. Let's reinforce. I got 151 yet. Yeah, I don't dare move off here. I only got three aircraft left. Put you on fire. Yeah, grounded. Okay. I don't think there's a sub. Oh, I can see. Let's get you out. I'm going to operate you out, I think. How much? Yeah, shoot. I got to take units, too. No. Can't. Cap's going to can't take you unless I move these off. 151 anti air. I need and I need artillery. Well, what do you have? I got heavy artillery. I still gotta get that fighter out, repair it. No, okay. I'm gonna pull you. guys are getting low but escort range what's the upgrade naval weaponry too Got to be getting degraded. There's a carrier right there. He's got subs somewhere. They are on the arch.
New York, here we are. He bit, he pulls in 97 MPP a turn. I get to what 250. Our national morale is 104. His is 99. That's because it's more Marines showed up. Yeah, look at these losses. Japanese losses. Oh, God. Yeah, it's just shy. Of 100 MPP. Oh. Well, yeah, I lost the plane deal. Bad weather here. Let's engage him. engage us anyway. We have to. That's the Congo. Sound or Tevu Tevu point now. Bastards. Let's bring fresh fighters in. can't just I could put them on transport and get them over here but they'll be sitting ducks we definitely need uh, our infantry over uh, I'm not gonna apologize this is critical here This is the Dakota, South Dakota. There's Australia. Light cruiser. Heavy cruiser. The Washington. I just wonder if I should return you. Let's 
six planes will be down to zero probably. I'm going to bring heavy artillery. That's 53. And, uh, yeah, I'll, I'll bring it. I'll bring, uh, down here. Okay. this can't get out oh. <laughs> I got 17 MPP the Australians or British got 20 so I haven't been able to repair my yeah I need this over too can't yeah it's this far yeah what I'm gonna do with the, with the Saratoga So up here, one, one, two. I certainly don't want to get this sunk. Now he's got three of these bastards. Jesus Christ. Put you on sleep. That'll remind me, don't use you again. Okay. Uh, you're on, you can only go, yeah, I'm going to have to get you over. Okay, well, I think, do I want a chance a heavy artillery? No. Not yet. All right, well, I have to decide about this. I'm not worried about his subs getting me, but is he going to try to round behind me? I don't. I think we'll shift, though. Or we'll get out. No, let's go back. Let's get our, let's get our planes. Yeah, I think our planes are superior to his. Yeah, I'm going to do that. Okay. Is that it? I think so. So the Battle of the Canal rages on. Fighters. Yeah, look at HQ Special Forces. Yeah, he's going to try to do an end run on me here. And we're going to be able to land in here maybe. Okay, well, that's going to take a few turns. January 6, 1943. Yeah, lost uh, an an air. That's kind of weird. Yeah. Yep. Okay. Carriers return home. Ooh, I get two hundred extra for U.S. Marine reinforcements. Oh, yeah, we need it. Well, what an exciting turn. Well, this is Ogro Bowser. Thanks for watching. I'll see you guys on the virtual battlefield. See what Tanaka does to me next turn. Uh, okay, well, at least we pushed him off a little bit. All right, we'll see you guys later. I am gone. Gone.